Hello, hello. Good evening to you guys. So now we're an hour early to do this. Another tips and guides for business uh, coaches and speakers. So I know most of you hate this time change, but for me, it makes my Facebook Live an hour earlier for you guys. So it's still 9 a.m. here from my end, but it is 8 p.m. from your end in the Eastern Time Zone. So anyway, tonight we're going to be talking about is your business ready for holidays? And how do you prepare your business for the holidays? Did you prepare your business so that for the holidays so that you can take a vacation you can enjoy the holidays with your with your family with your loved ones without really thinking about did i s deliver this thing to my client does my team know what to do you know things like that so we're going to talk about that tonight and i'm going to give you three things to keep in mind so that your business will be ready for the holidays and you will enjoy your time, your break time with your family. So let's dive in. Number one is you have to meet with your team. Ask their input, their, their feedback on what happened last year that you can do again and or not to do again so you know gather your team have this conversation with your team have a meeting with them um, if you have a project manager or if you have a virtual assistant and some other team members in your team then gather them and just you know brainstorm just ask for their feedback um, take a look at you know what were the the marketing things that you did last year that were successful and what are the things that you did that failed so as for their experience um take a look at the experiences of your of your clients what worked successfully what failed take note of that and then you know just do what was successful and make it better and then, of course, for the things that failed last year, then definitely do not do that. Or maybe tweak it and then try that again and see if that will work. So that's that's one thing. You can also, you know, discuss with your team members their vacation leave. So like, for example, with... Like last week, I think it was last week that I received a message from one of the project managers that he will be taking a leave in December um, for five days. I think it was five days. <laughs> I actually need to take a look at it again. But he sent me a message and asking and saying that, you know, he, he needs a break. And this only happens. I'm very grateful for all of our team members because they're you know they're really passionate with what they do and they are really committed with with the work with the clients projects and it you know december is the time that they've been waiting for for the whole year so that they can take a break so i got that message from one of our project managers and asking for a five-day leave off in december and you know these are the things that you need to discuss with your team because you want to make sure who will be taking a vacation who will be covering for that person how long is the vacation um do you allow a one week vacation uh for your team or you do not maybe the maximum is three days but if it's just once a year then why not your team needs a break as same thing as you do um how long is like i said how long is the vacation will be so that you can figure out who's going to cover for that person are the system and processes in place um you know will they still be reachable in case of 
you know when if you have a question some clarification on the things that they're going to be leaving behind and you know the person who's going to cover can still kind of like still reach out and ask questions for clarification so those are the things that i really believe that it is important especially now that you know we're almost half of the month and it's gonna be fast before you know it it's christmas time you know people are rushing to do their their christmas shopping um people are taking leave um you want also your brain is also on holiday as well so these are the things that you you have to keep in mind i think that is number one thing number one um the most one thing that you need to prioritize in your business when there will be a holiday break like christmas and new year um now it's approaching thanksgiving in in the u.s so you know even though it's a one one day off for you or a long weekend off you still want to enjoy that moment wherein you're just gonna spend time with your family and not think about the business and your team got it covered for you so those are the things that you need to to remember um you know again meet your team ask for their experiences ask for their feedback um have um take a look at what happened in last year the previous year and what was working well and what failed and then ask your team who is going to be um having a vacation how long it's going to be who is going to cover for that person um is everything ready is there an sop or is everything documented so that it's easy for the other person to take over while the real person in charge is on vacation of course when when someone wants to have a vacation as much as possible you don't want to bother them with questions because they needed that break the reason why they ask for a vacation is because they want to to recharge you know uh, breathe and not think about anything about business or work or whatsoever so as much as possible before the vacation happens everything is sorted out i believe that here at great work online we really take it to heart to put everything in you know to document everything so that even if let's say for example worst case scenario one of the project managers is sick the other one is on vacation the other one is fully loaded with project i can easily myself take over because everything is documented <coughs> excuse me so documenting everything is really important if you haven't done that yet well maybe tonight or tomorrow start making sure that every task every project are being documented so it's easy for you worst case scenario take over stuff all right number two is create a marketing strategy you know if you are in the business that can provide discounts and promos you have to create a plan for this you have to create a strategy for this now it's all about how are you going to promote this plan how are you going to promote this strategy are you going to do an ads so that involves time if it's time crunch at least have two weeks prior the launch that will give you somehow enough time to gather leads and you know um promote whatever you're you're going to launch whether it's a discount a promo a free stuff or or whatever if it's time crunch two weeks ideal is two weeks prior the launch of course it's better if you can promote it like a month 
worth of promotion then you'll be able to gather all the leads that you can get and it's like you know the more you see um you know the the lead will not buy right away the first time they see your ad or the first time they see your your promotion um so it it helps that to have that length of time to promote whatever you're trying to to offer them so is it going to be a paid ads is it going to be a boost post whether it's on instagram facebook or on linkedin if you don't know that yet linkedin also provides um, it has a feature of boosting a post so if it's going to be a free master class um, whether it's a Facebook Live, we're in kind of like something like this, we're in you lay out some plan for your for your market, you know, um, whether it's um, a paid ad or um, it's a paid webinar or it's a free webinar, um, just to gather leads, then it's really up to you. Freebies, like if you're gonna be, um, promoting or offering freebies like for example downloadable pdfs um cheat sheets you know something like that or tutorial videos then of course these things these are some marketing ideas that you can you can do but you have to have a plan or a marketing strategy for whatever you're going to do to promote the plan so so that's that number three and the last thing is but not the least is you have to make sure that your website is ready you have to speak to your website developer to make sure that during the holiday your website is not gonna shut down especially if all your courses links and pages and free offers and your the video tutorials um your promos and all the details for whatever you're gonna launch are not gonna shut down or not gonna be you know there won't be any problem there will be some instances isolated in cases wherein it's beyond your control it happens sometimes you're not doing anything but it's you know the the website hostings issue on their end that makes your 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 website not functional at that day that's why you have to have a meeting with your web developer to make sure that everything is secured everything is ready do you need to upgrade um, some memory if you are expecting a lot of traffic that can that can affect your your website as well it can slow down the the loading time of your page so make sure you you mention that to your website developer is the security up to date because if it's not and it needed to renew your security your ssl and it happens during the holiday you might have trouble you might have trouble reaching out to your web developer because well your web developer is also on holiday so make sure before everything goes everybody goes on holiday then your website is ready will it handle traffic are you when are you going to promote or launch your your offer or your promo your discounts your whatever um during the holiday it has to be scheduled and it has to be discussed with your web developer if everything is all sorted out um are the emails integrated successfully so let's say in the last months i've discussed about doing what is lead generation and what are the things that you can do to to gather more leads and what type of lead magnets you're gonna create so let's say for example in every promotion or in every offer that you create that you do that is that has a landing page then definitely there will be an email that is integrated to your offer if you noticed you yourself personally if you 
avail of something. Let's say you stumble upon or you're doing your research and you stumble upon a page and and there is a downloadable whatever whether it's a video whether it's a cheat sheet whether it's a calendar for something um, a digital resource there will be um, some sometimes most often you will receive an email saying thank you um, there are some some offers that you can easily download like after you click download now it gives you it directs you to the to the page wherein you can download that digital resource that you availed um it, but it also will ask you um we would like to send you something as well give us your you know you have to enter your email address and your your name the basic information and once you do that you're going to receive something so it's it's really like that because you want to generate leads so you know you have to make sure that if you are launching something your the email that is integrated that is related to that download um to that digital resource or to your offer also has the email like conf confirming confirmation email confirming that they really um you you gave them access to download um you ask for their permission and you receive this thank you email confirmation email make sure that that is working because i'm pretty sure you invested some time and brain power to work on this stuff to create a strategy plan and if it's not working it's a waste of time it's a waste of time it's a waste of money and that's not good so make sure that you coordinate this thing small pieces together with your website developer and test 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 you have to test to make sure you have to see it in your eyes that it is working do not just rely on on saying hey it's um it's done you have to take a look because people can make mistakes right so you have to take a look you have to double check if everything is working fine so guys those are the top three ways for you to be able to get your business ready for the holidays there's one more thing make sure that you track all this so you can review them after everything is done and make it better the following year so guys let me have a recap if you want to make your business ready for the holidays one meet your team discuss brainstorm know who's gonna take um, have a vacation document everything so that whoever is going to take over the task will have an easy um, transition number two is create a, a marketing strategy um, you have to 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 make sure that everything is in place that you have a system in place um, you know what are you gonna do will it be a paid ad will it be a boost post um, it's a lot cheaper if you don't have that budget yet to really start with to launch a, a paid ad what type of digital resource are you gonna offer is it paid or is it free um, and then third one is you have to speak to your website developer to make to make sure that everything is secured everything is sorted out everything everything is syncing everything is aligned and all the materials are ready for your launch so that you can enjoy your holiday now guys if you have trouble or you're still confused what am i going to do it's november already it's almost half of the month and i haven't figured out what type of marketing i'm going to do and i want to you know i want to launch something i want to offer something so that i can grab more leads and you know eventually convert that into sales here's the answer guys 
if you need help and get some clarity on what needs to get done how you can do all the things that i just mentioned so that you can prepare your business and get it ready for the holidays book a call with me and david for an assessment call and we will help you it's gonna be a 30 to 60 minute zoom call it used to be uh, a 97 dollar call but we are offering this now for free and it's not gonna stay free forever so grab the chance now while it's free and i'm telling you guys that when you walk out from that call you will have something to implement into your business right away now if you want to just have this marketing plan ready for you figured out for you then you can avail our gwo on the go this is an ad hoc project if it and if it's that just that that you need then we can definitely help you with that that is the gwo on the go and the first step is to go to our website greatworkonline.com and book an assessment call with us now if you have everything planned out but you need a team to implement all of your strategies and you are making five dollars five thousand dollars a month then you need to be in this package plan project management and digital marketing service we have a full digital marketing team that will help you implement all of your plans all of your digital marketing strategy and you don't have to worry about anything but to wait when it's going to be you know executed when it's going to be implemented all you have to do is present to us the plan and give us all the materials we can brainstorm maybe we can take a look as well not maybe we can take a look i can take a look whether your plan is workable doable feasible and if we need to tweak it then we can tweak it and then we are ready to implement all right these are the things that we we created for you guys at great work online so that we can help you in every areas of your business in wh whatever situation you're in in your business whether it's just you know you need clarity you need to to brainstorm with us then that is the assessment call with me and david again for all of this um, offer that we created for you your first step is to go to our website greatworkonline.com and book that assessment call with us i hope you guys were able to get something out of this uh, tips and guides business night uh, with me every tuesday now at 8 p.m eastern time zone and 5 p.m pacific time um guys if you have anything that you want me to discuss um you want to have some clarity um that you want to know something about digital marketing or project management as well just drop them in the comment below and i will try my best to discuss them with you next time until then i hope you can implement what you've learned tonight and i wish you all the best and i hope that your business will be ready for the holidays all right, take care and have a good night. Bye.